Excuse me. <coughs> Today's song, Maybe Next Time by Jamie Miller, is about the struggles of unrequented love. We're all going to have an affiliation with this and the hope for a second chance with a past love. Imagine. I always say to move forward in life, you must use your feet to move forward. But there are a lot of people that wish to go back to a former love and start all over again. But as Jamie says in his lyrics, there's the, that side of frustration and it comes out in the lyrics, not being able to follow this gut feeling and confesses their love to somebody they believe is their soulmate. You can move on from a past love and be with somebody and realize, no, that person was the person I should have been with. But unfortunately, you must look forward and for karma to come round, it very rarely comes round to give you a second chance with anybody. Because once it's broken and you move on, it's, it's so rare that you are given a second chance. But despite those feelings of being, being frozen and disappointed, Jamie in this song faces that rejection by holding on to the thing that we all hold on to. What is it, everybody? It's called hope. That they will find love with this person in the future. Does he? We'll go through the lyrics and see if he resolves it after the video itself. My special contribution to this song is, this is a fan-based fan video you're going to see, but there was so much screaming for the two artists, the voices were drowned out. But I loved the fact that on YouTube, there was a visual of them singing this song. So I'm calling it my CC Euro Pop music contribution visualizer for Jamie Miller and the very beautiful Mora del Torre from the Philippines singing maybe next time and what you're going to hear over this video is I've silenced the screams the, uh, all, all the fans screaming and what I've done is put the audio music to it and combined the two so that way you'll get the visual of them singing a very beautiful song. And it goes something like this. And we will just have to, fingers crossed that my timing is good. Broken, cause I could swear that we were made to be. Standing on your doorstep, now I'm frozen. How are these the words you're telling me? Now I'm all alone, I know it too well And I know it won't help But I'm telling myself Maybe next time I'll be in love You give me everything instead of giving up Maybe the next time
I'll be enough You'll give me everything instead of giving up music i'll cut it all out i think that went really really well it gives you a visual of a, of a stunning stunning song with the two stars today which are jamie miller featuring maura del lettore filipino i have to say I, i'm feeling like but we have to get into the lyrics because that's what this show is all about and you're waiting to have your cup of tea and go home or do what you're doing First one says, Mum says, trust your gut, but I think mine's broken. Because I could swear that we were meant to be standing on your doorstep. Now I'm frozen. How are these words you're telling me? Think about what it says in the opening line. Mum says, so it's a passed on thing that all our mothers or our fathers ever say to us. Trust your gut feeling. I always say that. 90% of relationships would never go wrong if people trusted their gut feelings. Because it goes into, now I'm all alone. I know it too well. And I know it won't help, but I'm telling myself. So even if you go back and you say, let's send a text, let's try and contact again, this person that I feel was my soulmate, the other person's probably moved on and feeling, no, 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 I'm not feeling the same here. Because the chorus is maybe next time I'll be enough, not you, I'll be enough. I'll give you what you want, say what you want. We'll work it out. You'll give me everything instead of giving up. Maybe next time won't be a waste. You'll be the one and not the one that got away. So I count down the days till I won't have to say, and maybe next time. And then they go into a few oohs and ahs. But the chorus, only emphasizes that repetition of the word maybe think about this it's a big question mark maybe are you willing to risk your pride for a second chance in love with somebody that you didn't show love to in the in in the beginning or you didn't have enough time and they felt they just needed to get away do you think it's worth pulling them back i don't know i don't know I can I would say I would always say no always just move on but when they say in the lyrics maybe next time as we all know it's implying he's willing to try again and give their all for this person but sometimes it's too late to do that and the post chorus with the oohs and ahs represents the singing longing and yearning for this love it's almost like when you're inside your head and you're going oh, oh god oh, i want oh, and you're like this it's that frustration side of it not knowing would it have worked a second time i don't think so i think you would have to change a lot of your habits you'd have to move forward and look at yourself and look in the mirror and be honest and say can i change as a person to accommodate this person back in my life and have I changed have things changed is it you know you just need to think about it very very carefully before you you snap mentally and physically trying a second time it takes a lot of effort and putting the words right and you know going over old ground I don't know I just don't know maybe if you're a person out there that has try it a second time and it worked out for you i say karma came around just to bless you as a lucky person because for 90 percent of people it just wouldn't have happened and then it goes into after all of those choruses it goes straight into verse two which says don't know why i watched when i know the ending want to skip right to the part it doesn't hurt thinking that night boarding that flight with a bruised up heart and a carry on bag a long lost love that I'll never get back. And you see, this is a up and down, yes, no, yes, no bit, because he said a long lost love 
that I'll never. So he's already resolving the fact in his mind. He wants, but he's saying, it probably won't happen. It probably won't. But the chorus says, maybe next time I'll be enough. You'll give me a you'll give me everything instead of giving up maybe next time won't be a waste you'll be the one and not the one that got away so I count down the days there's almost a self-blame here saying you're the one that walked away you're the one that didn't put in the effort i put in so there's almost like he goes up in emotions wanting it but goes down by saying mm, it's not going to happen but blaming the other person and i always say then it's a no because if you don't take responsibility for your actions and tried harder to do something sit them down communicate talk if you didn't try any of that you deserve to be a part and learn by your mistakes is what i say for the next relationship it really is because it keeps going through it throughout the whole song so my in verse two that suggests he's been through the heartbreak before and is afraid of being hurt again but he's already hurt himself he's repeated his actions however they still won't the other person doesn't give it a second chance and get it back with this person who got away then it's not worth it i just feel the bridge in the outro that repeats itself in the themes of hope desire and struggle to let go of, of a past love is what it's all about the repetition of the chorus and the pre-chorus of the song reinforces those emotions overall it is a song a poignant expression of the universal human desire everybody to find love and the hope of a second chance even in the face of disappointment and heartbreak some people need to know so that's my summary thanks everybody for listening take care